how to express your address with Fluent American. And a key thing to know about addresses in the United States is it's going to start with the actual specific location, as in the number of the address. So for instance, here we can see this bar, Barcelona Restaurant and Bar, is located at 263. After that, once you know the actual house number or the building number, then you can give the street address. So you need to find the major street that the building is facing. So in this case, it's Whittier Street. We can see it's East Whittier Street. That's what the E stands for. After that, you're then going to use the city, followed by the state and the zip code. So again, altogether, this address would be 263 East Whittier Street, Columbus, Ohio, 43206 for this location. So let's now take a look at another address example, this time in New York in Brooklyn. And here we can see that this is actually going to be located on a corner. And when you have a corner address, what you can do is just say the names of the streets. You don't actually need to say though, the whether it's a street or a road or an avenue. For instance, here for Ninnocent, this clothing store, you can just say it's located on Albany and Lenox. But again, if you need the full address, you're gonna start with the number. So 778, then Albany Avenue, the city, Brooklyn, state, New York, and then the zip code 11203. Notice these patterns when you're also saying house numbers. 312, 312, 1054, 1054, 23, 23, 1405, 1405, 1210, 1210, 416, 416. Now also just a quick reminder that there are many different types of roads in the US and this will maybe become important when giving your address. So let's just take a quick look at them again. Road, road, street, street, avenue, avenue, boulevard, boulevard, alley, alley, freeway, freeway, expressway, expressway, highway, highway, toll, toll. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel.